cut short as it was just getting started. Ten-month-old Zaire Davis gunned down in this Marrero home with his father nearby. A 16-year-old was also injured in that shooting. Jefferson Parish Sheriff Noel Norman says the boy's father initially said he was in the back of the home when the shooting happened, but then he changed his story. We uh, got information actually from Zaire's father who has, for lack of a better term, been a reluctant witness uh, and through repeated efforts of our investigators have gone back to talk with him as it relates to the identity of the shooter. Detectives were able to connect 27-year-old Jonathan Manuel's fingerprints to the crime scene. The boy's father also confirmed the shooter's identity. Obviously, he knew this shooter. But it's unclear how the two knew each other and who was the intended target of the gunfire. He was all I had, like, like somebody I know that for sure loved me. The boy's mother distraught when we talked to her day after the shooting, still searching for answers in this case, and so too is the Jefferson Parish Sheriff's Department. We still have another shooter, uh, so if anybody has any information as to that individual, uh, we would ask that they come forward and contact the sheriff's office. The sheriff wouldn't give any indication of a motive in this case. That's still under investigation. He did say several weapons were recovered when Manuel was arrested this week. We recovered a 40 caliber handgun in the vehicle as well as a 9 millimeter handgun uh, at their residence.